you know, it's me, your little boy, K. Samson. I have this message to give us today, chosen ones. You know, your anointing select them <laughs> and do it and chase them away. It select and do it and also delete. You know, that is why you should understand that everything that happened to you is by the anointing in your life. You know what I'm saying? Our God is not a God of mystic, but a God of mysterious in all his ways, in all his doing. So let me be real with you, choosings. They can't stay too long in your life, not because you are not good, not because you don't want them, not because of the fact that maybe they will destroy you. No, it's because your anointing is too raw to welcome what? To welcome idiot and what? An enemy into your life. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So let me tell you, many of us need to know this. Why people run away from you particularly? Why people are always uncomfortable whenever you are around? Why people feel so depressed, frustrated when it comes to you particularly as a choosing? It's because your anointing is too raw to welcome people who are not, you know, benefit, who are not, you know, uh, 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 needed in your life, who do not have what it takes to stay in your own life. <laughs> You know, many of us carry something that we have no idea of, bro. We carry the kind of anointing that we have no idea how powerful, mighty, and strong it is. Because the truth is this, you need to know. People cannot stay in your life if you are anointing. Do not need them. You know what I'm saying? They can't stay too, too long in your life because your anointing is what select, is what alert, is what delete. Trust me, this is why sometimes people whom you need the most in your life will be the one that will just be running away for no reason. <laughs> oh God, that these are the people that you think that they will stay too long. They will be there with you. They will stay with you. No matter what happens, no matter what takes place in your life, they will always be by your side. You will just be shocked that one day you will just wake up. They are no longer around you. You will just be like, what have I done, bro? What have I done? I mean, because many of us have this encounter. What have I done? Why is it that? Ah, these people, ah, they are the one that I, I, I was, you know, thanking God for giving me opportunity to be with them. Lord, I thank you. Lord, I, you know, Lord, I, 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 I truly appreciate you for making them to be in my life. One day you just wake up and, and, know, and notice that you are alone. You know, <laughs> you just wake up and see yourself alone. Ah, where is all these people? Where, what happened? You, they can't tell you. You can't even explain. You will explain tired because the anointing in your life is too raw that there is no place for enemies to occupy. That even people who are hiding it, they are hiding, you know, they are hiding to be your friend. They are pretending. You just see, you know, one thing, God will just black to boom. The next thing, their character will start to so Some of them will start to say, eh, eh, we, we don't want to be around you. We are going back. We don't want to stay in your life. <laughs> don't tell you how mysterious God is, bro. How mysterious God is. People whom you are praying to be with for too, you have been praying to be with them for too long. You, you, you think within you that these are the, what, the, the helper that God has sent into your life. <laughs> Not knowing that that is the end of them being within you. Not knowing that their mission, God knows their thought they have towards you that you have no idea of. God knows all their mindset. God calculates and figure out what they are there to do. God knows the reason why they are what within. <laughs> You know, it's not so crazy that people whom you thought they would be your side, they will just leave you. Many of them will just disappear for no reason, no accurate reason. You'll just be like, what is really happening? What have I did to myself? What have I done to myself? You have not done nothing. Your anointing is what is absolutely working. Your anointing is what is accurately performing work that you have no idea of. You know what I'm saying? The anointing you carry. 
<laughs> that many of us we have been praying for helper. You know, we you pray, Lord, I need a helper. I need someone that that will do or that will help me in this business. Someone that will help me in this marriage. Someone that will, you know, before you know the anointing you carry, you, so people will just be attracted to the anointing. Ah, this anointing is too good. Though. Ah, this guy is doing well. This guy is doing no good. Before you know, they will just walk into the into your life with big stomach. Some of them will walk into into your life with a, with a dried bone. They will just be walking. It 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 even not be me. Who else? Or <laughs> Some of them will be like, eh, 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 if I don't do it, who else will do it for you? Before you know, God will be like, ah, you know, if you don't do it, who will do it for him? I am the one that do it, that anointed him. I can do all things through or through me. I can bless them. I can fall. Before you know, God will just wipe them away. You will just be like, where, 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 where is that, my friend? Where, where have you been? Hello? You will call that they will respond because God have already heard what you are not able to hear. God has already figured out things that you are not able to figure out. God has already calculated their mindset, their thought, their opinion, their agenda, their expectation towards you that you have no idea of. Many of us are blaming ourselves because people are no longer what, comfortable to be in our life. You don't need to blame yourself, brothers. You don't need to be angry because God saw and hear all that you could not be able to do or to hear. God understands everything that you are not able to understand about them. You know what I'm saying? So remain blessed.